Okay, I'm at the downstairs on Blythdale. Here's the situation. The only way down right now is through the outside staircase, but it could be attached from inside. There's a way to do that. And you could also just cover this outside staircase. This lot behind the back is going away and right along this brick patio is going a fence because really all that area belongs to the house on the other side of the fence. So they're fencing that off right now. And then the yard to this house is everything here, which goes all the way up to the street and is giant. So it has add-on potential. Big street though, as you can see. But this is a huge amount of yard to play with in a pretty sunny area. Um, it goes all the way to here, then the fence would go right here, and then the brick patio stays inside. So that's the way it works. This is the downstairs of the house. I'll show you. Um, agent says they're really looking for around a million four. So the house is pretty insane. Hate the street, love everything else. So here's the downstairs. It is giant. There's a plumbing and stuff in there. I'll walk you through. You see it goes all the way. It's like a whole other house. I don't know if you could legally divide it and call it a separate unit, but who cares? I mean, you can't in my house either, and I have three of them. So this is where you would build a little bathroom or something, most likely, because it's where the water is. Um, this is the current laundry room for the house. This thing is giant. Wait till you see. I mean, I could seriously move down here. Yeah, you right, right, if, you out. if you were gonna, yeah, exactly. If you were gonna okay, do and all this, this just goes forever. And this, and there's a storage, giant storage room that connects to, it used to be a garage, but they have another garage, connects to the driveway. And then, back here, the entire thing just keeps going underneath the whole house. So all this can be converted too. Like you can turn this into a giant home or you can leave it storage. And again, spiral staircase could drop down to here, etc. So you could have a neat business down here. Yeah. You know, this place is insane. Uh, cool. So gives you the idea of the downstairs. I mean, it is giant. How many square feet is this downstairs? Uh, it was upstairs is eighteen hundred about, so it's probably about the same. I'm about the same, maybe a little bit less. Probably doesn't go all the way to the front. But yeah, that's so really cute. This little uh, little cut rack. Little thing, thing, yeah. And look at this old bicycle. That gives you the idea. And then you'd come out. There'd be a fence right so at the nice. end of this brick. That lawn is no longer yours, but you hang a left, and everything from the brick over is yours. So this whole yard, all the way up to the street around the corner all the way up is this house's property it could be an add-on that's why you can add so much space because the lot's so huge but you know it's a bit of a freeway up there all right that's the scoop i'll take you back up so you can see how it works there's a street and then here there's a deck up here um above the garage Here's the street, downhill to the garage. Here's the little garage. Probably couldn't fit my car in it, it's more storage. And then here's the house, and I'll make a separate video.